Hello Aries, welcome to the channel. Hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. This is a timeless message and when you're drawn to it, it's when you're meant to hear it. If it doesn't resonate, then you can look at your moon and rising signs for greater clarity. These decks have been shuffled. I'm just doing it because it's easier in front of the camera. There we go. And we have home. Now this could be literally your home. You could be moving home. It could be about your home life. Uh, but this is more as well. It's not just about home. It's about feeling comfortable in your surroundings and comfortable in your own skin. Feeling at home is highly important as well here. Soulmates. Now, it's important as well that we're enjoying our, our, our family, our soul tribe, whoever we share our home with. It's about having good friends, people have got your back and people that you can trust. And I did say it's about feeling comfortable in every area of your life. So make sure that you're around the right people at this time. Um, and make sure that you, people that are around you are not are, are got your best interests at heart, most definitely. Wandering path, enjoy the journey. So you might be on a new journey here. You might just be not sure where you want to go. You might be looking for new horizons here. He's got his compass there and he's ready to take off. So you might be going exploring. You might be moving home, like I say. You might be moving to a new country. You might be going on a holiday. Um, but you're in, it's about enjoying things. And when we're enjoying things, we have to be around the right people for that to happen. So you and your family, your soul tribe could be planning a new journey here. Or something brand new together. You're all on the same page here. The magician. The eight of wands. Six of swords. Five of Swords, the Chariot, which is forward moving energy. This is Cancer energy. You could be Cancer or dealing with somebody with Cancer who is a Cancer or has Cancer in their sign. The Queen of Cups, the Two of Wands, the Ace of Cups, beautiful brand new beginnings here, and the Seven of Cups. Now, this is about brand new goal setting. So it's either you, your family, um, your group of friends, whatever it may be, you're setting new goals for yourself. It could be you and your soulmates. If you've got dreams and aspirations, make sure, if it's you on your own, that you have the right people around you to support you at this time. Because the people around you should be supporting you with your dreams, not bringing you down over them or questioning you. So this could be anything like we said, but we need to be around the right people at this time. We could be setting new goals. We could be moving home, we could be planning a trip of some sort, uh, planning new jobs, enjoying the journey, being prepared to do whatever's needed here to, to achieve our goals. And the reason I'm saying that is because this is a five. And we're going to have to find some compromises or we might have to cut our losses somewhere along the line. It could feel like a bittersweet victory that we're needing to, you know, achieve before we can go forward. So it might be, you know, we're ready to buy a house here. Um, because we're choosing here, to, to, we're making choices about a path for growth. So we could feel like we're leaving something behind. We could be leaving home, for example, or leaving a group of people we've lived with to branch out on our own and buy a brand new house. Or we could be leaving our college mates and ready to take a year out, you know, leaving our family behind. It, this sort of thing. I'm just giving you examples. Um, but whatever path you're choosing here, you could feel as if it's a bittersweet victory. But we want to focus on what we're coming out and what we're not, not what we're leaving behind. So there could be compromises having to be made here, um, most definitely. But we're choosing a fruitful path. We're setting our goals and we're prepared to make our choices and go down that path. And that's the beauty of this, because this is about brand new beginnings for your happiness. Brand new beginnings for happiness. Spirit wants you to be happy with your choices, your goals that you're setting. They want you to fall, listen to your, your intuition here. She's a very psychic queen. She's very compassionate. She can go, you know, she take other people's uh, opinions into consideration. But in the end, she has to do what's right for her and she follows her heart chakra. So this might be something you've wanted to do for a while. Uh, it's about enjoying the journey. You know, the Goals aren't achieved overnight, so there could be some hiccups along the way where we might have to, there's been battles we have to overcome, hurdles we have to overcome. Um, it's not going to be plain sailing for any of us, or life would be boring. 
Uh, but we're definitely going to be able to follow our heart chakra and we're going to enjoy these new goals. It's following your heart here. Follow your heart. Enjoy things. Um, and claim the blessings that the universe has to give you. There's lots of blessings on this path for you. As long as you're on that path of inspiration and desire and you're coming from the heart chakra, you're enjoying anything. So this could be anything for anybody. It could be buying your home, moving home, going on holiday, achieving a new goal. It's about feeling at home with yourself and everything around you. So your goals are yours. They're personal. You're going to feel good about them. And you're going to go forward here. Now, we don't know everything that's going to happen, like I say, as you go along life's path. We've got a five and a six here. So when you're making your choices or overcoming your hurdles or finding your compromises, it's going to move you forward to more success. So always remember there is going to be challenges and hiccups along, life, along life's path. But as long as you're following your intuition and you're happy with what you're doing, you'll overcome these challenges and you'll enjoy the journey. And you will gain the clarity you need to move from choppy waters into calmer waters. So you will be supported uh, as you go along life's path by spirit in the universe to go forward. And you will resolve these problems because you're enjoying what you're doing. And that's the beauty of this, enjoying what you're doing. Now, for goals that you're setting, there might be good news coming in. This is kind of travel. It could it travel as well. Like I say, it could be a holiday you're planning with people, or it could be you getting the good news you wanted over your goal setting or the goals that you've set. So it could also be moving house, moving country, any kind of forward movement. But it's going to happen very, very quickly. And you're going to go forward. Once you've made these compromises and you've made your choices here, you're in a very good place because you're you're following your intuition and you're following your heart, which is going to speed things up. And you're prepared to open yourself up to new blessings and new opportunities. And that's what the, this, these are two fast moving cards here. So this chariot energy, there's no reins on this chariot because the goals you've set are your own. You're inspired. There are things that you want to achieve. You've got the Midas touch here. Um, you've definitely got what it takes to enjoy uh, something brand new here. So you'll move forward very, very quickly here. You don't need the reins. And like I say, good news. A lot of happy times ahead. New goals we're setting. We're, we're following our heart. We're inspired. We've got, you know, this is the holy grail. Happiness in every area of your life. And you're going to deserve it. You deserve it because you understand the spiritual journey here. You're prepared to set new goals for yourself. You're prepared to listen to your intuition and follow your heart here. You're prepared to be open to all the opportunities and blessings that the universe has to give you. And you're going to enjoy this journey. You, I do understand that there's going to be hiccups and you might have to make compromises to get on the path or throughout your path. But as long as you focus on your goal, you'll be very successful. And you understand that. Aries, you're understanding this uh, about goal setting and having the Midas touch. Inspiration. You're being inspired to set goals. Be prepared or you'll soon receive a visit from the fairy of inspiration. Come dusk or dawn, she shall call at any time. So this is definitely you. You're inspired to go forward and you're going to be very happy with whatever you achieve here. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.